We're professionals, but not at this. Yeah. I am, as, as they say in North California, I'm hella blasted. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear heavens, this movie doesn't suck balls at all. Do you ever just sit back and feel weird? Radiation is awesome! Yeah, it makes it makes a lot more sense after a bong hit. Little kids are douchebags. That kid does not understand spatial relations. I, I, I don't want to sound like a bad person, but if he's that dumb, I don't think he deserves to reach puberty. That's all I got to say. <laughs> Darkman, are you full of hatred? Uh, not full. <laughs> I mean, Do you there's, have any there's room for food. Every character has to have angst, otherwise they're not an interesting character. Oh, that's Christopher for Walken. <laughs> all right. <laughs> or Samuel Jackson. <laughs> Ooh, boy. This place is a pit. I hope I have hobo stab insurance, because <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> he obviously watched The Matrix before he made this movie. He should have got the guy who did The uh -huh. Matrix movies. Or right. he should have just went to Asia and picked one guy out. <laughs> any guy. <laughs> any, any Asian guy. I will make a, a plug for the most recent like series of Expanded Universe Star Wars books. I don't know how much of them you guys read. Oh my god, you're such a nerd. But how'd you make movies about electricity? Well, you know, we rubbed two sticks together until Jeff Goldblum caught fire. Maybe I'm tuned wrong, but I think Jeff Goldblum's freaking rad. That's yeah. awesome. The girls are like, he should put a shirt on, and you're like, no. <laughs> I would pay to blow Jeff Goldblum. <laughs> <laughs> anyway... On the list of visuals wow. I would like to move past. Yes. <laughs> it's a good thing that I just went to the bathroom because I'm worried about shooting my pants. Yeah. <laughs> listen. Listen. Uh, real quick. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Everybody in the theater right then, just their balls just went straight into the throat. <laughs> my balls were already in my throat. Is that where you keep them? If I went to a place that gave me an orgasm every time I took a bite of their cheesecake, I'd go back. Yeah, but <laughs> I'd go back there a lot. Yeah, nobody would take you. So here's Phoebe Cates, yes. Oh, yes, I do recall her breasts. Yeah, uh huh. I got to squeeze a girl's boobs with skeleton robot hands, <laughs> and, uh, you know, sometimes you get to do some fun stuff. I like it like I like cheese, except I'm lactose intolerant. So you like it, but it makes you fart. Exactly. Okay. David right. Fincher's semen is made out of candy and brilliance. Oh, holy shit, this is gross. It's like each time you get in a new relationship, it's like, I don't know what to put in where. <laughs> We're going to discover this one together. It's an adventure. I'm sure they have this conversation. <laughs> It touched me. It touched me in my slimy part. He's got the complexion of a finely roasted turkey. He does. <laughs> Look at that beautiful, sweaty man. What? What? He's done to a turn and ready to serve. Uh, I got a fan letter from him where he uh, threatened to burn my nose hairs out with a torch. Uh, but I took that as actually a high compliment. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! The man has an asshole for a chin. Tiny, tiny nipples, good or bad? Round the room, go. They really should have just said, you know, Sama hikes, enormous fun bags, and fantastic ass <laughs> lend a great visual style to an otherwise lackluster film. That right there is a sexy woman. But she has eyes that are like the eyes from that one chick from the beginning of Star Trek. Uh, everything is about Star Trek with you. <laughs> yeah, thank it you really for is. noticing. It really God. is. What the fuck is wrong with that character? Yeah. He, he wired it up wrong and blew out his own cockpit power. By the way, if you've never blown out your own cockpit, you should try it. You should it really, feels you great. really should try and blow out your own cockpit. Oh, that's what funny. the funny joke you made there is funny. I just thought of a, uh, a great homoerotic vampire movie. <laughs> <laughs> like there's never been one of those before. <laughs> wow, that blew yeah. my mind just now. I yeah. feel like a douchebag. I can't believe I lived to see that happen just now. <laughs> that was really quite something.